Today I'm going to tell you a dream I've had. And this is uh, back before the Japan quake. Anyways, I was leaving this mansion, a bunch of us were. It was like we were all had to leave, don't know why. Then I was taken to these clouds. I was shown um, what appeared to be the White House and many row of government buildings, U.S. type stuff, all the way to this bridge. And from there, I saw a wave or like a storm thing. It wasn't like a flood, it wasn't water, but it was something like a flood just sweeping over all this. Um, I was kind of like the size of the buildings themselves, so before it got to the White House itself, I went and I stood there in front of it holding back this wave or this flood or storm or whatever it was. Then I was immediately put back where I was. And the whole thing started again. And this is, at this point I figured, okay, this is God trying to show me something. And I was trying to impute what he was trying to show me. After that, um, the whole thing, the whole flood just covered everything. Whatever, or storm, whatever it was. Then I saw these people, or whatever they were, um, run across this flood, or whatever it was. And immediately I asked, or I thought to myself, are these the saints of old? I wasn't sure what these things were, but that's the question that popped into my mind. Um, after that, I turned around, and staring me right in the face was, I believe, to be the Antichrist. Because his glory was flaking off of him. It was like a fake glory that he had. And it was just falling off of him. And it just was not pleasant. After this... I kind of like, I asked God, I asked Jesus for a word. And the only thing I got back was a touch on my shoulder saying, Son, was the only thing I could hear. I immediately tried looking as soon as I got my, someone touched my shoulder to look for Jesus, but he would not be found. At this, I became very heavy and started crying. And I was placed back to where I was originally in the dream, where we were leaving these mansions. At this time, a man that I knew very well from my church came up to me and said, Now is not the time to cry. It's time to move. So... We all started, kept on moving out of this place. Um, and I was just thought to myself, how is it that he cannot, he's not crying even though he's been through so much? Um, so that's the dream I leave you guys with. I'd like to talk to you about also a vision of George Washington's vision of America. An account of this vision was given in 1859 by an old soldier. Um, it goes on, talks about who he was and everything. The first pearl is talking about you know, the revolution and everything that happens in America. The second peril that happens, um, and he said that it will soon come to pass, was the civil war that broke out in America. The third and most fearful peril that Washington's vision talks about stretches over all of America. And in this, I found very similar to my dream with the whole flood. 
the next part of it is it talks about the heavenly intervention this I found very interesting relating to those I thought were ancients or ancient saints instantly a light as a thousand suns shone down from above me and pierced and broke into fragments the dark cloud which enveloped America at the same moment the angel upon whose head still shown the word union and who bore our national flag in one hand and a sword in the other descended from the heavens attended by legions of white spirits these immediately joined the inhabitants of the american who i perceived were well nigh overcome but who immediately taking courage again closed up their broken ranks and renewed the battle i believe this is talking about um what I saw next after the whole flood came about the at questioning about these the ancient saints of old so in the third peril I saw a lot of similarities to what I saw in my dream George Washington's vision was something that helped me understand what this dream was all about <clears throat> Leaving the mansion means it could mean like all our wealth is basically taken away from us. Destruction is coming to America completely and utterly. <clears throat> and God is going to intervene for America in some way. And after all this, the Antichrist, I guess. Okay. So. Pray about this. Pray about all this, and this is what I have, and this is why I believe the Lord is showing me. When will it happen? Don't know. God bless.